We make a lot of cool stuff here at Hacksmith Industries, but not everything we build sees the light of day. Sometimes it's just not epic enough for our make it real. Other times, a project gets buried under a pile of more urgent content. We've been doing some digging and have decided to dust off a lost project to share with you guys on our vlog channel. Big thank you to Ben and Jordy for making this project possible. Hey guys, Ben here. We love video games here at Hacksmith Industries. And we also have done some pretty intense cosplay. Over a year ago, we received a special gift from the CEO of the VR company, Control-V. He challenged us to turn this prop into a working Metroid arm cannon, and that's what we're going to do. Firstly, we need to get the movements of the arm working so that it can open just like it does in the game. To do that, we need to install new servos and program the movements. Next, we need to install a 15 watt blue laser to melt our targets. <laughs> oh, the cardboard is actually on fire. <laughs> Just in case it goes out. <laughs> he has no clue what's gonna happen to him, poor thing. So, to feed the wires through to connect the laser to the Metroid base, we have to drill a bit of a hole in the Metroid head. No wind. Bad wind. Is there a focus ring I can touch?
Hacksmith Arm Cannon may cause eye melting, serious burns, blindness, spontaneous combustion, and more. Samus Arm not included with Cannon. Pretty cool, right? Unfortunately, we don't think the 15 watt laser we purchased was anywhere near 15 watts. Either way, it ended up being a really fun project for the team to work on. If you want to see more content like this on the vlog channel, let us know in the comments section below. Thanks for watching.